repeated. Unique. She grows stronger every update. Who's that Pokemon? It's Xiangling. But why? Wei Xiang is so strong. Since release, the big three supports have been Bennett, Xinxiao, and Xiangling. And after four years of this game, Xinxiao already got a five-star version. Yeah. And Bennett has several elemental specific replacements, and he was also affected by the changes in substat scaling. Yet, Xiangling stays undefeated, despite the fact that several parallel characters and sub DPS have been released. None of them come close to Xiangling, and the reason why can be summarized in three points, which by themselves aren't enough, Let but together make Xiangling the strongest pyro of field unit. First, Xiangling has the best pyro application in the game. Her voice doesn't have ICD, internal cooldown, which means she basically applies pyro every single hit, making her perfect for reactions, especially vaporize. She vaporizes every single hit. Second, she has a standard attack crit scaling. The standard DPS scaling is for sure more difficult to farm in comparison to HP or defense scalings. However, this makes her buffing more universal. She greatly benefits from Pyro Resonance because of the attack buff and basically gets a double buff with Bennett. And on top of that, she often gets a weapon that benefits her a lot and synergizes perfectly with her scaling, which is why a lot of players say that she gets stronger each update. Third and final point in Probably the most important one is snapshotting. Basically, a snapshotting means that you're getting a buff from a skill. Let's take Bennett's buff, for example. And even if the burst is finished, Shanling still gives the buff from that burst, making her a lot stronger and easier to use, and you don't have to worry about timing her in order to not lose DPS. So with Bennett, she basically gets fire resonance and energy plus the buff from this burst. Let's she snapshot. This is why the national team is so popular. Xinxiao, Xiangling, and Bennett together make a perfect vaporized team with basically a permanent buff. It's easy to play, basically the only role is to always put Bennett's first first and cast Xiangling's skill inside of it and that's basically it for that rotation. What about Xiangling in Natlan? Well, Natlan Major represents the dethroning of a fire support queen. If the pattern of Archons being top tier supports continues, then the fire Archon might just replace her. However, since Shelling has been released for a long time, she has a lot more builds and weapons available. And most important, she is free. So what do you think? Do you think Shelling might get replaced in Natlan?